Hello, sweet souls. Happy Friday, July 8th. This will be your full length reading on TikTok and YouTube. Um, so if I exceed the 10 minutes, follow me over on YouTube and watch the full length version. Um, I'm not going to ask anything. I'm just going to start pulling from multiple decks and see what we need to know. St. Michael, uh, please return to send or anyone sending ill will through thought, word, or action toward myself or the viewer. And uh, we're going to ask the Holy Spirit, angels, and saints, what do we need to know for our greater good? What do we need to know? We need to know for our greater good. Wow. You're coming out as the Empress. So you have definitely elevated um, spiritually. You're in a higher vibration. You're in, um, in an energy of attracting. Um, you're abundant. You're very loving and you're nurturing, uh, but you're very protected. This is divine feminine energy, whether you're a man or a woman. Um, this is an energy that has been through so much, but has learned the lessons and has elevated spiritually. You went through a heartbreak. You went through a lot of pain and suffering in your past, but from that you've elevated. So the divine is rewarding you now with the wheel of fortune. These, this is about fate and destiny, but this is about things lining up for you in your favor. So things are about to change in your life. Um, I'm going I'm to get another deck and clarify. The bottom of the deck is collaborating, working well with other people, helping others. Um, I want to, let me just get a couple. Please clarify the Empress. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels and Saints, please clarify the Empress. Yeah. You're in a position, again, three of pentacles, to help other people from your experiences, from your lessons. Um, you are in a position to help other people, to learn to grow from their experiences. So let's clarify the Three of Swords. Three of Swords, please. We'll clarify the Three of Swords. We got two cards. Wow, so the Three of Swords, like I said, you are protected by God. From this pain, from this experience in your past, you were divinely guided. This was orchestrated by the divine. This was a necessary happening in order for you to learn this lesson to elevate. So it was destined, this experience. You are divinely protected. And now, because of this experience, you're in the energy of manifesting. Manifesting anything and everything that you desire. It's You're being blessed because of your hardships, because of your lessons. Please clarify the Wheel of Fortune. Please clarify the Wheel of Fortune. Yeah. Inner strength, power. You're definitely in your power. And it's not, this is, this is a, an energy of strength and empowerment that not only you see, but the world will see. Because you're meant to be in an elevated position. You're meant to be in the spotlight. You're meant to be in a position of authority helping other people. Is there anything else we need to know? Look at this. Like I said, you are destined for amazing things to come into your life. Because of your hardships, because of your lessons, because you elevated spiritually, you listened to God, you did the work, you healed. You loved yourself, you know your value, you're being blessed with happiness, and financial abundance. Now, if it hasn't happened yet, hold the vision because it's happening. This is the hand of God. Bring in opportunities that are gonna elevate you, not only spiritually, but financially. This is a new beginning that leads to so much happiness. Is there anything else we need to know, Holy Spirit, Holy Angels and Saints? Anything else we need to know? Yeah. An inspired new idea, a passionate, creative new idea. Also. The hand of God. Look, we have the Ace of Pentacles and the Ace of Wands. New beginnings that lead to financial freedom. A blessing. A blessing, yeah. Because now you're in your power. Proud and confident. Very driven, spiritual. You're taking care of yourself. You're loving yourself. You're knowing your value and worth and you are divinely protected. God protects you in all that you do. God watches out for you. Is there anything else we need to know? Or 
look at this. We have the emperor. Communication coming in from a divine masculine or feminine. Take it how it resonates. For those of you that have not met your divine partner, you will receive communication from a divine masculine that's being led to you by God. It's divine love, another ace on the bottom of the deck. This is your divine counterpart coming in to offer divine love to you. This will bring about victory in your life. Victory. Victory because you learned the lesson you needed to learn and you trusted in God. All right, I'm going to go to another deck real quick. What do we need to know? Holy Spirit, Holy Angels and Saints, what do we need to know for our greater good? What do we need to know? Oh my goodness, you guys. Yeah, so you have been elevated spiritually. You're the high priestess, very connected to the divine, highly intuitive, psychic. Um, you are being blessed because of this connection with God, because you're trusting God. You are being given divine wisdom. And it's leading you toward this Ten of Pentacles generational wealth, building a legacy. It's your birthright. This is, was your destiny, but you had to go through all of this pain in order to learn these spiritual lessons, to elevate, to be in alignment with your higher self and God in order to call in these blessings by being in this energy. That's beautiful. Anything else we need to know? Holy Spirit, my angels and saints. Anything else we need to know? Anything else we need to know? What about this conflict? Yeah. What about this apology? You know, you being in this energy of receiving, being elevated, is going to cause people from your past to be conflicted. You may have people coming back that have done you wrong trying to apologize. But you're in control of your life. You're in your power. And whether they choose to apologize or not, it doesn't matter because you're unaffected by drama. You're unaffected by, by people trying to cause um, any issue. They can't. They can't cause any problems for you because you are connected. You've gone through a transformation and you're not triggered anymore like you used to be in the past. You just, you're in a higher vibration. You just move away from it. I mean, God takes you, um, he moves you forward away from things that are not in alignment with you. You are coming out as this masculine king of pentacles, very grounded, stable, and financially secure. You're focused on your own stability. Yeah, you're focused on what it is that God asks of you. And, you know, any communication that comes in that sideways, you defend yourself. You're like, I don't have time for this. Um, I have more important things to do. I have a more important purpose than to deal with people's drama. If you feel guilt for what you've done, that's between you and God. Take it up with God. Because we don't need an apology. I just said take it up with God and there's the God card. Yeah. We don't need an apology. We don't need an apology. We walked away from the pain and suffering. We healed. Victory is ours. Now justice is being served and we're celebrating our life. We're celebrating love. Because we did the work to awaken. We elevated to the Empress. We're calling in a divine partner. Your regret is not my concern. I'm on a new path, a new journey. So that's amazing. Stay focused. Stay focused on what your divine mission is. Stay focused. And, um, you know, whoever tries to come back in from the past because they're heavy in regret, uh, karmic soul connections, they need to take it up with God. We don't we don't need the interference, the distraction, and we're not going to allow it anyway. So just um, give them to God and don't pay it any mind, okay? Victory is yours. You're the empress. I just split the deck and look, empress and victory. There's nothing that's going to take that victory from you. Absolutely nothing. Yeah, I just split this deck. Queen of Pentacles. You are meant to be blessed financially. You are meant to be elevated spiritually. And there is no one that can prevent it. None. Not one person on this earth. Not one soul. Because it's destined by God. Okay, guys. I love you. Have an amazing day. Bye-bye.